Hey guys, welcome back to Bernard from the BTN HD. And yes, the top seven useless Windows 10 features that Microsoft should take out of Windows 10 now. So let's get started. So the first one in my list is the People app. Remove it. It is. I've never used it. It's just there, constantly looking at me. Uh, you are able to hide it. Uh, there are hacks to disable it if you're creating a custom reference image within your nine to five job. But I don't really have a good sense of why Microsoft has the People app. So remove it. Number two in the list. If you go inside the Fire Explorer, you see your basic folders that everyone is so used to seeing: desktop, downloads, pictures, music, video. But what the hell is 3D objects? Get rid of that folder. No one uses it. What's the point of using it? I don't know. Get it out of there. It's just, it's just there, right? Next one on the list is, uh, I guarantee you a lot of you guys are not using Microsoft Edge. You're probably using Chrome or Firefox. Uh, but the My Feed, it's, I think it's kind of useless. The My Feed, I, it's nice to have a nice overview of what's going on with the world. But uh, having it right in front of my face for Explorer, I don't like it. Get rid of it. One last thing, right? Next one in my list is, uh, well, I, I actually did a video with you guys on how to disable this. And I think Microsoft got smart with their, you know, upcoming builds and they kind of took my wretch hack away and they disable it. But it's all about disabling bin from your uh, search. So when you're typing something in and you want to search something locally, it actually goes out on the Internet world and start grabbing information that you don't really need. Uh, it, it just basically has been um search engine within your start menu you don't really need that especially if you just want to search stuff locally so I'll, I'll assume get rid of that stuff it's just nonsense next one definitely the history timeline uh this is weird this kind of freaks me out because it gives me a rundown of what i do every day it's a history of what i've done throughout you know all year round why do you have this uh, it's kind of freaky that my Windows 10 actually has this information and it's gathering this information behind the scenes, but it's there. You are able to clear out the cache and everything, but come on, who wants this? Seriously, get rid of it. Then we got two more on my list. Number six on my list is Candy Crush. Why are you installing, you know, games within our system, right? No, get Candy Crush out of here. If we want it, we will install it, right? And the last one on my list, top number seven, is Solitaire. I know Solitaire was out on Windows XP, but who really uses Solitaire? Get rid of it. Get it out of here. It's just space that's being taken within your Windows 10 environment that you don't need it. Uh, and that's it for my top seven. Well, those are my top sevens. I know there's a lot more within Windows 10 that you guys would think it would definitely be on this list. If so... Leave it at the bottom. What do you think should be on this top useless features of Windows 10 that you would like Microsoft to get rid of? Leave the comments right below. Don't forget about hitting that like button. Make sure to hit that subscribe. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.